Hello, my name is Jordan and I'm here to talk about the Oxygol G dissolved oxygen sensor. In this video, I will show you the setup and calibration of the sensor with the Flexa 402 unit. Before beginning the initial setup, you need to remove the shipping caps from the sensor. Then you will unscrew the cap and rinse it with an electrolyte solution. The membrane cartridge needs to be filled using a pipette with 1.5 milliliters of the electrolyte. Then the cap needs to be screwed back on carefully and tightly. After plugging in the Flexa unit, you need to go through the initial setup and configuration of the sensor. First, we need to go to the correct channel. Then we need to go to the sensor menu in the bottom right corner. Then settings and configure sensor. Oops. You need to choose the appropriate settings for your sensor. For the Oxygold G, we are choosing a polarographic sensor with the NTC 22K temperature element. Then we will scroll down and make sure that we have the correct sensitivity and voltage set. We are using 35 nanoamps per part per million and 0.65 volts. The sensor needs to sit for a minimum of two hours in order to fully polarize. After that has happened, we can go back to our channel Click on the sensor menu, choose calibration, and then we will do a 100% air calibration. Our sensor is in the air, and then we will choose to adjust it. It may take a little bit of time for the reading to become fully stable. After the reading has become stable, you are going to accept the air calibration by clicking next and then accept. If this is a new sensor, then you would like to reset the sensor wellness data, so we'll click yes. And now our calibration is complete. Thank you for watching this video setup for the Flexa 402 with the Oxygol G dissolved oxygen sensor. Have a great day.